So, Cal, what do you love about desert racing? Why is it such a passion for you? Oh, just going fast, I know, it's pretty cool, and I enjoy, uh, you know, the red sand. It's just, it's uh, awesome to ride in, and uh, when it's wet, it's even better. So, you know, normally when Hatter rolls around in the middle of the year and winter, it's hopefully, you know, normally wet, and uh, no, it's nothing better than wet red sand and, and going fast, and I uh, love it. Supercross and motocross laps only take a minute or two. In desert racing, how would you explain it to somebody who's never seen desert? Because it looks like motocross or it looks like supercross to the outside world, but your laps are kilometres long. Yeah, it's it's totally different, hey? Like, I am, um, you know, grew up racing motocross, supercross, short, sharp. Um, still got to be fit, obviously, but um, going to the desert side of things, it's, you know, two hours to anywhere up to four hours um, in, you know, it can be really hot, cruel and heat or cold and chilly and all sorts of conditions. It can be dusty, it can be wet, um, or it can be, you know, perfect. It's uh, it's not really like Supercross and Motocross where the track's prepped and watered through the day. It's just, you know, what's there is what you get and um, you got to deal with anything that comes to you ahead. and. Um, yeah, it's brutal, but that's that's what I love about it. You don't know what you're going to get, and it's um it's bloody tough. Bring on 2023, Cal. It's <laughs>